With a moment of silence, in the place that 25 years ago was the Cypress Freeway, dozens gathered to honor the 63 lives that were lost in the destruction caused by the Loma Prieta earthquake. On this day, as we reflect, as we remember, as we give tribute and honor to those who lost their lives, to those who labored professionally and as volunteers to save lives, let us remember that we're all in this thing together. Community leaders recognize accomplishments and improvements in preparedness across the Bay Area since the 1989 earthquake. California continues to have and build upon the greatest mutual aid system that exists anywhere. Um, that allows our first responders to help one another in times of need, um, which they do all the time and they do um, better than anyone. Meanwhile, in a long day symposium held by the Association of Bay Area Governments, others talked about what we can do for the future. A couple of the things that we really want to accomplish are to create a state seismic, safe, seismic lifelines council with pilots in the Bay Area and in Southern California and Los Angeles where we can bring together all of the utilities and the infrastructure providers to jointly plan and prepare for earthquakes. The other thing that we want to do is to upgrade our building code standards. Topics included building Bay Area resilience with policy actions, preparing for the next big quake, refining infrastructure resilience policies, and learning lessons from the past. You know, since then, building codes have steadily improved um, and, and our understanding of, of the seismic sh shaking has improved based on strong motion data gathered by USGS and, and, and the California Geologic Survey. Community preparedness continues to be a top priority. One way to increase community preparedness is participating in drills. The symposium coincided with the shakeout. So at 10.16 that morning, participants dressed in suits and business attire were warned of the upcoming drill with a prototype of the earthquake early warning. The Bay Area region has diligently applied lessons in resilience since 1989, with ongoing risk reduction in resilience building to better prepare for earthquakes.